Hello, this is Alex from Trainer Day, and now I'm going to show you how to use our training plans with Zwift. Okay, so here I am in a plan that has been cloned or created, a private plan that I can now edit and drag more workouts on or remove or whatever. And I'm going to click download here. So I click download, I set a start week. This isn't extremely important for Zwift, but I'll go ahead and set it to next week. I'll download the the ZWO type. I click download and here I have it. And then I will, I double click on the zip file that was downloaded. It creates this folder. And here I am, let me show you. If you go on a Mac, it's in your documents folder. It's called Zwift. It's very similar on a PC. I think it's also in documents, but inside you've got something called workouts and you've got your user ID. And so if I click on that, I can then take this whole folder and drag it into there. And I now have uh, a folder inside of workouts and my user ID folder. And and then when I open Zwift, I'll go ahead and open Zwift and I'm going to pause the video right after that. I'm going to go ahead and pause the video. Here I am resuming the video. Um, Zwift is loaded. Took a few minutes um, or a minute or something. I when I'm in here ready to ride, I click on training here. And if I go into custom workouts, you can see I have that folder. And inside it, I have week one, day one, week one, day two. Anyway, and then you can just click on it and you can go ahead and click workout. And then the next day you can come back or after you finish, you can come back and you can delete that workout and then so that you remember that you're working on the next workout. And that's it. Thanks.